Hey, welcome back to the show. This is your show for Disney tips, tricks, and how to live your best Disney life. Is that what it is, Amanda? That's what it is. Hey, do you know what we're drinking tonight? What are we drinking? We're drinking our Beauty and the Beast drinks. Beauty and the Beast drinks. We just made these. They're not bad signature cocktails. Mm. And they're themed after Beauty and the Beast. I love them. I've got a blue martini. Yeah. And I got a lemon shell, like a lemon cello. And yours is a lemon cello. Now, yours used to be more yellowish. It's turning orange. But it's turning orange because the enchanted rose themed sugar rim. Sugar rim has melted into your drink since we made yeah, them. Yeah, that's okay. It's but if different. you guys are interested in watching how we made these yes. and what the ingredients are, we'll leave a link in the description below. You should check out our uh, video where we made these drinks. But these are fantastic. And I'm really excited to be drinking them. And you know what we're doing tonight? Yes, I do. But you can do Talking about the Wilderness Lodge. Yes, we are on a resort series, five favorite things series. Mm -hmm. And next up, second in line, is the Wilderness Lodge, which is our like second favorite mm -hmm. resort right now. We love it. What did we talk about last week? Polynesian. Of course we did. So this week we're talking Wilderness Lodge. And then do you have a quiz? I do have a quiz. Ooh, do you want to know what the quiz is tonight? Yes. So I've put in a map okay. of all the Disney parks and Disney Springs. Okay. I'm going to name a location. Yes. And you have to locate it and circle it on the map. Oh, that's really interactive. I like it. It's super interactive. Now, I've circled all of the locations on a map, but you won't be able to see them till the end. Okay. And we'll see how close you get to the 20 locations that I have. All right. I think it's going to be really fun. Is there a prize? There is a prize. It is the prize to end all prizes. Really? That good? It's something we've been talking about for a long time. Okay. So do you have five things that you love? I do. About the Wilderness Lodge? I have more than five things, but we're going to just need five tonight. Amanda, what is your number five top thing you love about Wilderness Lodge? All right, I'm going to start with the pool. You love the pool? I do love the pool. What do you pool. love about the pool? The pool is very relaxing. I just like the view from the pool. You're in the woods. Mm -hmm. Like, there's great scenery. You're right on Bay Lake. Mm -hmm. um, the side's pretty fun. There's it's also, pretty fun. The best thing about the pool is the hot tub. The hot tub is huge. It has two hot tubs, doesn't it? It has two hot tubs. Mm -hmm. And every time we went in it, it was always dead. Yep. I, it's just a really nice vibe, a nice relaxing chill It's very vibe. quiet. It's very chill. Yes. It's very easy to get into. Yes. And I love that the pool is something that you can kind of... Kind of just swim around, and and when you get to the other side, you don't see the same things that you see on the other side. Yeah, it's a very nice pool. Yeah, and I do like the slide. It's not the best slide, no. but there is a slide. Yeah, yeah. What about you? What's your number five? Uh, my number five thing was, do you know if you take the boat out to the lake and you look back at the Wilderness Lodge, it looks like a bear. I didn't know that. You did? You really didn't know that? No. Yeah, it, like it looks like a bear sitting like this. And you got the face and the paws and the claws coming out. That is so cool. It's shaped like a bear. Wow. That's awesome. If you didn't know that, I'm going to put in a picture of it right now. Yeah. And you can see that it kind of looks, you can see the eyes and I everything. I want to see that. It's, it's really cool. It's very neat. Okay. And I think that that is such an, an amazing design aspect of the Wilderness Lodge. It's yeah. one of the coolest things. All right. Very cool. My number four is the geyser. It's so relaxing. It's so cool, and mm -hmm. it makes the grounds, like, just so neat that you get to go and look at watch the geyser. We waited till like, it exploded, and it, it, it was a whole like, experience. It, it is a very cool experience. Yeah. It explodes once an hour, and yes. it takes probably like five ten. to ten minutes. Yeah. To, I, I don't know how long, but yeah. it's very cool. Yeah, we should put it in here. And it's a neat experience, because we did do it, and yeah, I'll, I'll throw in some, uh, some shots of it. All right, very cool. What's your number four? My number four was the walk around the outside of the property out back. Mm. The cabins are brilliant and beautiful. Oh my gosh, I wish we could stay there And one the day. view of Bay Lake. Uh, there's a running trail that leads you over to Fort Wilderness. Mm. And I guess after all of it, it's four or five miles, which is really cool. I didn't know there was a running trail at Fort Wilderness. I, I didn't either. Get there. I didn't think so, but I looked it up and there's a running trail that takes you through Fort Wilderness and it'll take you back. Very nice. So I think it's really cool. The best, you know, one of the coolest things is that you are in Disney, but you don't feel like you're in Disney. You feel like you're in the great North Woods. It's yep. beautiful. In the middle of nowhere. Yeah. The woods and mosquitoes. Yes. All right. My number three is similar. It's the location, though. The location to Magic Kingdom. Mm -hmm. You can take a wonderful, relaxing boat ride to Magic Kingdom. 
But you could also take a boat ride to Fort Wilderness. Yep. You could go to their dining and like like we did one time on our trip, we actually took the boat from Wilderness Lodge to Fort Wilderness and had their uh, trails and buffet. Oh, and the it was trails amazing. and buffet. And we walked around and it was beautiful. And then we walked and then we took the boat back to Wilderness Lodge. Mm-hmm. And it was just perfect. It's yeah, so it was nice. amazing. It was the best day I think we've ever had. Ever because and then our our boat skipper like sang to us. Remember? Mm-hmm. Oh, it was just so beautiful. The the lake and the fireworks. Yep. If you if you're on the boat during fireworks time, they'll stop the mm-hmm. boat so you can see the fireworks. So and it was one of the best days that we've ever had. Yeah. That we didn't go to a park. Yeah. We hung out at the Wilderness Lodge all day. We went swimming and we just chilled. And then we went over to Fort Wilderness at night. And we had Trails End. Yeah, we are big, like, pushers for, you know, Disney is not just the parks. Disney, you could do a whole trip planned around the resorts. There are, there we do are that. so many things. We we do entire trips based solely around resorts. not going to the to parks and, and not just even doing staying resorts. at the resorts. <laughs> exactly. Just exploring. Resort hopping. They're beautiful. So my number three was actually um, the boat ride. But my, my number three was the fact that you can take a boat to Magic Kingdom. Yes. I mean, you can't get better than that. There's nothing better. I mean, well, the monorail is the greatest thing. The ever. monorail and it's also the walking. Easiest and fastest. But the boat ride, especially because if you take a boat during the fireworks time, they will typically stop in the middle of Bay Lake and spin the boat around so that you can see the fireworks. And it's free. And it's free. And that's happened to us multiple times. Yeah. A couple of times. Yeah, for sure. So what's your number two, Amanda? My number two is the restaurant, Geyser Point. Oof. Oh, we had a great experience at Geyser Point. It's absolutely beautiful, right on the lake. The food is amazing. The drinks mm-hmm. are amazing. The the dining seating is amazing. Like yep. you sit around these comfy chairs. Oh, we had such a great time. It's it was just relaxing, beautiful, yeah. wonderful. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So Geyser Point was actually my number one. Oh, really? What was your number two then? My number two was the geyser. Oh! Really? Because I think the geyser is so cool. The geyser is It's cool. so unique at Disney. Once every hour, the geyser goes off. Yeah. And everybody looks forward to seeing it. And you get yeah. to go just sit and watch this thing go. I thought it was just the neatest thing. It was neat. So those are my number one and twos. Okay. What's your number one? Oh, my number one is the lobby. The lobby at Wilderness Lodge is in insanely amazingly beautiful you walk in and you just it just takes your breath away yep the details in every design aspect of that lobby is just amazing to me i love it i I love the characters outside of the gift shop yes yeah particularly i really like the seating in there Mm -hmm. they have these great big chairs with a big huge fireplace yep sitting in front of the fireplace in the middle of summer wasn't appealing to us but the fireplace was phenomenal. Yeah. It just looked unbelievably amazing. Not to mention they have this water feature that goes into the lobby and out. And there's like a little bridge. Yeah. And we even went all the way up to like almost club level as far as we could and looked down the lobby, remember? Mm-hmm. And got some great shots of just like looking down from the top. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's beautiful. amazing. Beautiful. What a great place. It's such. It, it, I didn't love it, but now I love it. I can't wait to go back and like eat at Whispering Canyon. Yeah. It it's slowly taking the number one place in my Disney life. We did eat at um, Artist Point, mm-hmm. the bar, there, with a bar there. Yep. One time, we ke- remember we came in, we're staying at Fort Wilderness, mm-hmm. and we had some good drinks there. It's a really sweet little, it's very cozy. Yeah, we had very, some drinks and we had some appetizers. Yeah. And it was very nice. Very nice. Very expensive, though, I thought. I thought. Yep. For the price. But for everything at Disney is expensive. So yeah. if you're going for how much it costs, then you're going to the wrong place. Exactly. If you're going for the experience, it was a great experience. It was. It was. And especially before we were ending our night, the experience at Artist Point was unbelievable. It was cool. And we've got lots more plans coming up. Yes, we do. Amanda, are you ready for the quiz? I don't know if I'm ready. I would like to introduce you to the Disney World map. On the map. On the map. Oh, okay. So if you'll notice, across the map, there's Epcot, Magic Kingdom, Hollywood Studios, Animal Kingdom, and Disney Springs. Yes. If you scroll into these places, you get a very nice view yeah. of it close up. Okay. <laughs> what I'd like you to do is when I name a place, you're going to zoom into it and circle where you think that place is. 
Mm-hmm. I've got 20 locations across Disney. Okay. And it's 20 locations across all of the parks and Disney this Springs. This is really fun. Do so I get the pen? I. The power. I have, I have circled all of the places and I will show them to you after you circle yours. Okay. And I've also, based on all of the maps that exist in Disney, I've removed all landmarks. So you are going into this completely blind. Wow. Wow. No pressure. The most that you have is a very small amount of information, like the entrance. Okay. Are you ready for location number one? I'm ready. Please find for me, oh, Canada. Okay. It's in Epcot, in the World Showcase. Mm -hmm. Canada. And all you need to do is circle where you think it is. Um, I think this is Canada. So I'm going to say, like, here. Perfect. Okay. I love it. Wait, you're going to tell me now? Nope. Oh, not till you the end? You won't find out till the end how you've done. So I, do I have to write Canada? Nope. Okay. All you have to do is your circles have to closely match up to my circles. Okay. So number two. Yes. Please find for me Jock Lindsay's. Ooh, okay. So that's at Disney Springs. Mm-hmm. Jock Lindsay's Hangar Jock Lindsay's Hangar Bar. Where do you think that is? Okay. Um... Let's say. Hmm. Let's say it's like. Now, even while I was going through Disney Springs earlier, yeah, I tried to do this blindly. I had a little bit of trouble, so I'm curious how you'll do. Hmm. I'm gonna say it's this. That's fantastic. All right. Please find for me Big Thunder Mountain Ooh. Railroad. Okay. Is it Magic Kingdom? In Fantasyland. Is it in Fantasyland? Sure is. Nope. I mean, sorry, Frontierland. Frontierland. This is big than a mountain right here. Okay. <laughs> it's my favorite ride, so I hope I know where it is. Can you find for me the Flame Tree Barbecue? Oh, that's over Animal Kingdom. Is it? This is really fun. I know it is. <laughs> <laughs> and Flame Tree is over past... It's right out of Dinosaur Land. Where's Dinosaur Land? Oh, you kind of know where it is, huh? Yeah, kind of. Good for you. So it has to be right around here? I don't know. Let's say right here. Okay. I love it. I'm not going (laughs) to tell you if you're right or wrong. Find for me the Haunted Mansion. Ooh, back to Magic Kingdom. Back to Magic Kingdom. I'm jumping around like crazy. Liberty Tree. Liberty Square. Liberty Square. Uh Uh-oh. Not sure where Liberty Square is? It's right here. Haunted Mansion. Oh, Oh, there it is. Wonderful. <laughs> okay. All right. Can you find for me the world of Disney? What? The world of oh, Disney. Disney Springs. Okay. The store. Yep. World of Disney and All Disney right. Springs. That's over. I'm going to say right here. I wonder if you're right. I don't know. We'll find I'm, out. I'm Can you find it. for me the first time in forever a Frozen sing-along? Oh, that's back at... Oh, wait. Say it again. The first time in forever, a Frozen sing-along. That's at Hollywood Studios. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, so that's over. I did that one blindly, and I had trouble finding it, so. It's over by Indiana Jones. It is. You're very close. So, you go in. Center stage. Um, I'm going to say... Right here. Okay. All right. You know what you need to find for me? What? My favorite attraction. Haunted Mansion. I already found it. What? What is it? Emo. Where's my dad? All right. Back to Animal Kingdom. Back to Animal Kingdom. Quick. All right. Um. Okay. Dino Land. It's right outside Dino Land 2. Okay. I'm going to say... You think that's where it is? I do. All right. Can you find for me in Disney Springs the Bibbity Bobbity Boutique? Ooh, you even told me, huh? Is in Disney Springs? I don't really know. I know it's like near the end. I'm gonna totally guess right here and say right here. Ooh, I wonder if you're right. I don't think I am. I've never been there. Find for me the Kilimanjaro Safari. Oh, back to Animal Kingdom. Back to Animal Kingdom. Safaris. I mean, this is going to be easy to find, right? Over here. We'll see. 
This is the track. It's right here. All right, I'll take that. <laughs> Fine for me. Casey's Corner. Back to Magic Kingdom. Back to Magic Kingdom. We're by Main Street. Here's Main Street. So right here. I love it. How about, can you find Tiffin's or the Nomad Lounge? Sure. Um, back to Animal Kingdom. Being that they're one kind of in the same. Okay. You go left for one and right for the other. Yeah. Just find the entrance to them okay. and we'll be cool. Okay, so that was right outside. Is, I'm going to say right here. Okay. We'll see if you're right. You're probably wrong. Can you find for me the space alien spinning saucers? Hollywood Studios. Okay. <laughs> Toy Story Land. We're almost done. Okay. Here. All right. There's seven left. The people mover. Okay. All right, Tomorrowland, People Mover. Here. Fantastic. Can you find for me? It's really funny. Living with the land. Epcot. Is it? It is. Are you sure? Yes. I don't know if it's at Epcot. Okay. Ooh, I'm going to say right here. Yeah? Yeah. That's where you think it is? Yeah. Okay. I mean, we'll see if you're right. <laughs> we will. Can you find for me the Festival of the Lion King? Okay. Back to Animal Kingdom. Uh, Festival of the Lion King. That's over in um, Africa? I feel like it's over here. Yeah. Okay. I, I think you should change it to over there. Okay. <laughs> uh, can you find the Disney Junior live on stage? That's back at Hollywood. Is it? Studios. Are you sure? I don't know and if it is. Disney Junior, Star Wars. I'm going to say right here. Okay. All right. Paradiso. 37. Back at Disney Springs. That's a bar. It's a tough one. Ooh. I had trouble finding okay. this one. So, the landing. Oof. I don't know. Right here. Oof. <laughs> That's a big circle, but I'll take it. Okay. Sprinkles. Back to Disney Springs. Back to Disney Springs. I'm going to say Sprinkles is like right here. Okay. And finally, can you find me Coral Reef? Coral Reef. That's at Epcot. Okay. The Seas. It's a restaurant. Is it? Lots of fish. Is it a restaurant with lots of fish? It was our first Epcot restaurant. We it was our there. absolutely first restaurant. And I uh, hate that restaurant. It wasn't restaurant. that great. It was terrible. Um, it was expensive, and we sat in the way back, so we didn't get to see the fish. Yeah, so I'm mad. Kind of lame. All right, I'm gonna say it's right. Okay, so if that's the land, if I sat with where Danny Tanner sat, I might like it. Wait, what? Why did I circle that? That's test track. Well, we'll have to find out. That is not living with the land. Do you want to take it back? Can I change your living with the land? Hit the eraser. Okay. That's living with the land. Where's the sea? I'm just going to say this is the seas. Oh, let's circle that. All right, well, Amanda, you've circled 20 places. Oh, my God. That was, like, insane, but fun. I know it was. I'm so worried Are you ready to see how, how you did? did? That was hard. I'm curious to see how you did. did so I am gonna okay? put I'm going to put my layer on. Okay. I hope I did okay. So here's how you did. Okay. You made gigantic circles. Okay, that helped me out. So okay, uh, let's let's start right at the top. Did okay. you get Big Thunder Mountain in Magic Kingdom? I hope so. Yes, you did. Yes. Did you get the Flame Tree Barbecue in Animal Kingdom? Yes, you got it. Okay. Did you get the Haunted Mansion? God, I hope so. <laughs> I've been there so many times. I really hope so. Yes, you did. Okay. Did you get the World of Disney? Yeah. Hope so. Yeah, you kind of did. All right. I mean, it's right there. Okay. I'll give it to you. Thank you. Did you get first time in forever a Frozen sing along? In Hollywood. All right. We so no, no, you did not get I first time in forever a Frozen sing along. No. Did you get Finding Nemo a musical? Mm. Yes, you did. I mean, you made a gigantic circle here. But I you knew, basically I knew got it was that building. I mean, I know. I get it. Okay. So how about the Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique in no Disney idea Springs? What that was, honestly. 
Honestly, <gasps> you did. I did? It's right up there. Oh, okay. Right okay. The top. All right. You did a great job. Oh, this, I'm sorry. This was the World of Disney. No, I thought that was World of Disney. No, this is Bibbidi Bobbidi Boutique. This is World of Disney. So did good. I zoomed in on the wrong thing. But I got them. You both. did. Okay. Uh, how about the Kilimanjaro Safaris? Ooh, I hope I got that. Far- Your circle was gigantic, but you got it. But why? It's not all that? No, I mean, this is the, the inlet right okay. here. <laughs> like the that's, line? That's like where it starts. Okay. But it's okay. Right. You did great. So what was the next place we went to? Was it Casey's Corner? Okay. Yes, it was. I better have gotten that one. Let's head over to Magic Kingdom. And you made a bigger circle than I did, but you got it. My marker was really thick. So, can we talk about Tiffin's for a minute? Yeah. Let's head over to Tiffin's. I don't see your circle here. I didn't get it. Where did you go? I don't know. Where did you go, Amanda? Where did you go on me? Over here. I saw that. You went this way. Yeah. But you know what? Should have gone that way. It's that way. All right, sorry. So there's Tiffin. So I apologize. No Tiffins. Now, did you get the space alien spinning saucers? I think so. Did you say they were right here? Yeah. They are right there, and you made almost the same circle that I made. Good job. I did go with that. How about living with the land? Now I know you had some trouble finding living with I the did. land. I had trouble. But at the end, did you circle this? Yeah. You, I mean, I you, you made this big circle, right? I wasn't sure. I had these two things here. I wasn't sure if it was that one or that one. Okay, perfect. Well, you did it, okay. and I'll give it to you. <laughs> now, can we talk about the festival of the Lion King? Oh, that was hard. That is hard, but you know what? I got it. At the end, I think you I got it, because the I... festival of the Lion King is number 23 on the map. All right. I did good. Disney Junior, did you get it? I think so. Where is it? Hollywood Studios over by Lake Star Wars. Now, you made a gigantic well, circle. Like you circled everything in that area. <laughs> but I know that you meant right there. I did. So I'll give it to you. The last three, Paradiso 37 oh, I had no idea. and Sprinkles. I guess. I'm not going to lie. You came so close. Look, right here is yeah. Paradiso 37. <gasps> oh, that is pretty close. Wow. And I think Sprinkles is 106 over here. And where did I circle? And, I mean, you circled like 46. I think, what's this? I don't know. Oh. I can't remember. It might have been too. Oh, I think this might, I thought was Sprinkles. Yeah, maybe. It's pretty close. But you came pretty close. Yeah. So 106, I think, was Sprinkles. And 40-something, whatever Paradiso. it was, was Paradiso 37. So I'll give it to you. That was hard. And then the final one, the Coral Reef. I had trouble. Is number 74. <gasps> where did I circle? You missed it. Where was I? I don't know where you circled. You were like way up oh, here. Oh, I was up here. Yeah, you were at number 25, which is not right. No, that's Hollywood Studios. Oh, that's Hollywood Studios. <laughs> I was over here. Oh, you were... Did you circle over here? Oh, maybe. That's like the seas, Turtle Talk with Crush. How do you think you did? I did about... I thought I did pretty good. I think you did like great. Blindly going into 80. it. Not knowing where anything is. Not yeah. having any bearings. Just looking at a map. I think you did great. If I had some, like, like you said, you took away the landmarks. If I had those landmarks, I think it would have been a little easier. Mm-hmm. But I like the challenge of taking away the landmarks. I thought that was really fun. All right, do I get a prize? You do get a prize. All right, what do I get? Are you ready for this prize? Uh, no. We've been talking about this prize for a long time. And Amanda, instead of giving you a package of the prize, yeah. I'd like to take you to a place where I can show you the prize. Okay. Would you like to go see the prize? All right. So we're not going to do the quiz prize live because I've already given it to her and we didn't get any film of it. But we want to show you what it was. What is it? You already know. I know. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's a TV it. for the kitchen. Yes. So we've been talking about getting a TV for the kitchen and playing 24-7 Disney stuff. Yes. Yeah, so every time we walk into the kitchen, Disney's just playing all the time. It's amazing. It's pretty fantastic. Yeah. And just in the mail today, the wall mount came so I could put it up on the wall and it could be Yay. out of the way. I love it. I'm excited. That's it. All right. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys next week. What are we talking about next week? Next week, we are going to the Contemporary Reservoir. Ooh, we've been there. Yes. And also, don't forget to schedule your Fast Passes. 60. Whenever. 30. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.